where uh, through through this pleading that that this is part of the stakes here? Absolutely, Lawrence. So with respect to Trump's appeal to the D.C. Circuit, good luck with that. I don't think he has a chance in the world in winning that appeal. May win something marginal around the edges. But, you know, before Judge Chutkin, who wrote the initial gag order opinion, before she ruled, during the time she ruled, after the time she ruled, I tell you, no one has made a more compelling case for the need for the gag order than a guy named Donald Trump. He provided the very best evidence against his appeal. And it's absolutely the case that the judges in D.C. are going to take cognizance of what's going on in Georgia. They're going to look even probably at this threat that, you know, you've been talking about today, because a threat like what happened in Georgia doesn't happen in a vacuum. They're fueled day in and day out by uh, former President Donald Trump's dangerous rhetoric online. And so, uh, you know, I think that you, as we escalate the punishments for violating the gag orders and so on, I agree with you uh, that money alone is not going to be enough. Jail time's obviously the kind of po the possibility that's being held, you know, held out right now. But I think Judge Shutkin has a more limited option, which she's already talked about in the earlier hearings, which is, look, Trump, if you keep you know, saying the kind of stuff you're doing and scaring witnesses and attacking prosecutors, the result is going to be, I'm going to move the court date up. And she's absolutely within her rights to do that. It would never be the subject of a viable appeal for Trump. And so I think that's another tool that she has. And I wouldn't be surprised if she uses it right at the next time Trump does something. Uh, Gwen Keyes, how do you suppose that this death threat that we now know about uh, was received, taken, processed uh, by your friend, uh, District Attorney Fonnie Willis? Well, unfortunately, many prosecutors are used to these types of threats. When I